If you watched the last video on cellular, you'll understand that Wi-Fi and cellular are not necessarily competing with each other. Instead, look at it as a marriage. If you have both together, you're going to be better off. Wi-Fi isn't available everywhere, but neither is cellular. Cellular is expensive, Wi-Fi is affordable. Together, they balance each other out so you have the best internet experience possible. The Wi-Fi Ranger can connect to public Wi-Fi from the rooftop mounted unit and bring that internet into the indoor router. And then you can tether your cellular air card, MiFi, or smartphone into the indoor Wi-Fi Ranger. Now you have Wi-Fi and cellular connected to one central router. It's preferable to combine Wi-Fi and cellular together using both at the same time when one or the other is marginal and there's not enough speed to get what you need done. Another popular way to use the Wi-Fi Ranger system for both Wi-Fi and cellular is to prefer free public Wi-Fi whenever available. If unavailable, start using your cellular data plan as a backup. This saves you money as you are not relying on cellular except when absolutely necessary. The Wi-Fi Ranger also allows you to track your data usage. This is essential so that you don't go over your limit each month and incur a lot of extra charges. The Wi-Fi Ranger can also create restrictions so that you don't go over your limit and the Wi-Fi Ranger can automatically stop using your cellular air card, MiFi, or smartphone whenever it approaches that limit. With a Wi-Fi Ranger, you can maximize Wi-Fi and cellular. The marriage between the two can either maximize your speed by using both Wi-Fi and cellular at the same time. Or if you prefer to save money, you can prefer free public Wi-Fi when it's available, and then only use your cellular data when it's absolutely necessary. 